Man United get transfer green light on 30 million pounds, Manuel Ugarte alternative, who can unlock 60 million pounds ace. Manchester United are in the market for a midfielder this summer, with Adrian Rabio, Manuel Ugarte and Martin Zubamendi all options. Or Sofian Amrabat could still return. Manchester United have multiple midfield options this summer, as the club are keen to bolster the middle of the pitch. A prospective move for Manuel Ugarte, their preferred target, has yet to move forward. Adrian Rabio and Martin Zubimendi are alternatives under consideration should there be no progress towards a deal with Paris Saint-Germain to sign the Uruguay international. Sofian Amrabat is also under consideration, despite United not exercising the option to buy in the deal that brought him to the club last season. However, another player who spent last season in the Premier League could be an alternative to contemplate signing. Fabrizio Romano reports that Chelsea won a deal worth around £30 million, including add-ons for Conor Gallagher. Negotiations are said to be taking place with Atletico Madrid, but that price may tempt United into a move. That fee is considerably cheaper than what PSG reputedly want for Ugarte. Keeping costs down could make it more feasible to keep who they want out of Casemiro, Christian Eriksen, and Scott McTominay while still sanctioning the sale required to sign a replacement. Romano reports the 30 mm fee has been requested by the Blues, giving United the green light to test the waters with a bid should they want to. Much like Mason Mount, Gallagher is in the final year of his contract. However, the West London club only want half of what they received 12 months ago from United. That could conceivably mean they pay Chelsea a combined £90 million for the pair, but Gallagher may be the perfect player to get the best out of Mount. The duo have played together over 30 times in their careers for club and country, with Mount scoring four goals and assisting another in those games, while Gallagher chipped in with three apiece. The current Chelsea player often allows his teammate to play a more advanced role. That is also the position Eric Ten Hag has used Mount in during pre-season after predominantly playing deeper last season. But Gallagher's arrival at Old Trafford would help get even more out of him. In the heart of Manchester, the atmosphere at Old Trafford was electric. The transfer window was buzzing with activity, and Manchester United were on the brink of securing a key signing that could reshape their midfield. The club's director of football, Sam Thompson, sat at his desk, reviewing the latest reports and transfer possibilities. United had been keeping a close eye on Manuel Ugarte, a promising young midfielder, but with competition from top European clubs and a hefty price tag of 30 million pounds, the deal was proving difficult. However, a new opportunity had emerged. United had identified a £30 million alternative who not only offered a dynamic style of play, but also had the potential to unlock the talents of a £60 million ace they were keen on acquiring. The player in question was Rodrigo Silva, a creative and tenacious midfielder from Sporting CP. Known for his impressive vision, work rate, and ability to drive the ball forward, Silva was seen as a perfect fit for United's system and an ideal partner for their target, the highly coveted forward, Gabriel Costa, who was valued at £60 million. The key to unlocking Costa's potential lay in having a midfielder who could provide the right balance of defensive solidity and attacking creativity. Silva's ability to deliver incisive passes and break down opposition defenses made him an intriguing option. Sam picked up the phone and dialed the sporting CP president. After a brief but productive conversation, the green light was given for United to pursue Silva. The deal would involve a structured payment plan with additional performance-related bonuses, making it a feasible option for the club's budget. As news of the green light broke, Manchester United fans were abuzz with excitement. Silva was known for his flair and intelligence on the pitch, and his arrival was expected to add a new dimension to United's midfield. The club's manager, Emma Clark, was particularly enthusiastic about the signing, believing that Silva's partnership with Costa could elevate the team to new heights. United wasted no time in negotiating terms with Silva's representatives, 
The deal quickly progressed, and within days, the transfer was completed. Silva's signing was hailed as a smart move, and the club's focus now shifted to integrating him into the squad and ensuring a smooth transition. As the season approached, United fans eagerly anticipated seeing Silva and Costa link up on the field. The midfield maestro was set to play a crucial role in unlocking the forward's potential. Meanwhile, in other news, Man United transfer news. Christian Eriksen price tag set as cut price deal given green light. Manchester United are closing in on a third summer signing after adding Joshua Xerxy and Lenny Yoro to their ranks, but there will also be more departures for Eric Ten Hag's side. Eric Ten Hag's Manchester United have been busy in pre-season as they aim to improve on last season's eighth-place Premier League finish. It's the first summer transfer window with Sir Jim Ratcliffe in charge of football affairs, and United have already been splashing the cash. Joshua Xerxy has joined from Bologna, with Lenny Yoro following in a big-money move from Lille. Ten Hag's side have been given an injury scare with Yoro forced off in a pre-season friendly against Arsenal, with two games to follow during Therry pre-season tour of the United States. They're up against Real Betis on Wednesday, with a match against Liverpool on the way three days later. Before the end of that tour, United might be able to celebrate a third summer signing. Here are evening latest lines from around Old Trafford. Manchester United are prepared to let Christian Eriksen leave Old Trafford for under £5 million, according to Caught Offside. The Danish international is in the final year of his contract and is not expected to extend his stay in England. Anderlecht and Ajax have both been linked with a move for the former Tottenham and Brentford man. The 32-year-old made 28 appearances in all competitions for United last term, scoring just once. Eriksen played 45 minutes from the bench in United's last pre-season friendly against Arsenal. United were beaten 2-1, but the game ended in a penalty shootout which they won. In the latest Manchester United transfer news, the price tag for Christian Eriksen has been set, paving the way for a potential cut price deal. The club has given the green light for negotiations to proceed, indicating a readiness to finalize the transfer under favorable terms. Christian Eriksen, the talented Danish midfielder, has been a key figure for Manchester United, contributing significantly with his creativity and vision in midfield. However, recent developments suggest that United is open to adjusting their stance on his market value, likely influenced by both Ericsson's current form and broader market conditions. The decision to set a cut-price deal reflects Manchester United's strategic approach to managing their squad and finances. By lowering the asking price, the club aims to facilitate Ericsson's move, which could be beneficial for both parties. This move might be aimed at freeing up funds or creating room for new signings as part of the club's broader transfer strategy. The cut price deal could attract interest from several clubs, offering Ericsson an opportunity to continue his career in a new environment while providing Manchester United with a more flexible approach to their transfer dealings. As negotiations progress, all eyes will be on how this situation unfolds and what impact it may have on Manchester United's squad and future transfer activities. Manchester United are making significant strides in the summer transfer window as they approach their third signing, following the additions of Joshua Zerkzy and Lenny Yoro. The club is actively enhancing its squad, with these new arrivals reflecting Eric Ten Hag's vision for bolstering the team's depth and quality. Joshua Xerxy, the talented forward, and Lenny Yoro, a promising defender, have already joined Manchester United, signaling a proactive approach in the transfer market. Their signings are expected to strengthen the squad and offer more tactical options for Ten Hag. As Manchester United prepares to unveil their third summer signing, the club is also focusing on streamlining the squad. There will be several departures as Ten Hag continues to refine his team. These exits are part of a broader strategy to balance the squad, create space for new talent, and ensure that the team operates efficiently. 
The anticipated departures are likely to involve players who may not fit into Ten Hag's plans or those who are seeking more regular playing time elsewhere. The club's approach to these changes reflects a commitment to building a cohesive and competitive squad for the upcoming season. With these movements in the transfer market, Manchester United's roster is set to undergo notable changes. The new signings will aim to make an immediate impact, while the departures will help shape a more focused and dynamic team under Eric Ten Hag's guidance. Eric Ten Hag's Manchester United have been hard at work during pre-season, determined to bounce back from their eighth-place finish in the Premier League last season. The club has been bustling with activity, both on and off the pitch, as they aim to reassert their dominance and challenge for top honors in the upcoming campaign. The preseason has been a critical period for Ten Hag to implement his tactical plans.